Okay, welcome everybody. Welcome to Hacking Culture Talks tonight and welcome to the Waag building. And my name is Dick van Dijk, I'm creative director at Waag Society and we are the, the media lab that's lucky enough to work in this, uh, this amazing building. Uh, just a few words maybe about Waag, as I'm not sure if everybody knows the Waag, but we are a foundation and we are researching the added value of technology on societal questions, so on aging, on uh, uh, education, those type of t topics where technology might have actually an empowering uh, p p potential and, uh, and, and how exactly could you realize that type of things. We, we research that by building prototypes and that's also kind of the context of this, this whole weekend that we with a group of people built prototypes because this is the public start of the Hacking Culture Bootcamp. And um, the bootcamp is something that uh, um, is, is, a, is, is a group of participants. M most of you, I'm guessing, are, are part of the bootcamp. And, 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 and there's a, a group, a new group that has joined tonight, especially for the talks. And we have a great set of speakers for you tonight. And they will hopefully inspire. Now, I'm sure they will inspire the concepts that will be developed over the next few days. Um, because we already started in a closed session on, at four o'clock this afternoon and, and I heard already some of the ideas bouncing off the different uh, participants and, and that assures me that there's fertile ground for the, the, the things that, that the speakers will be addressing tonight. The focus to talk a little bit about the bootcamp is, is on the use and reuse of cultural heritage and, and we all know of these great collections that are out there that have really engaging stories and what the participants in the bootcamps will do is kind of map those stories to newest newer technologies and specifically on multi-screen applications. Um, and that they will do that supported by a team of experts from different European contract, uh, countries and, um, and they are uh, around here as well. And they will support them uh, on techn technology development, on content development, but also very much in thinking conceptually and, and, and see how to incorporate the, the collections from multiple sources, including Europeana. And um, to say a few things about the, the place where you are, you're in the anatomical theater. This is the, 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 the place that was home to the surgeons guild in the 16th century. You see that in the, in the reproduct, reproduct, reproduction behind you, where the, 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 the painting of Rembrandt's, uh, uh, the, the, the anatomical lesson of Dr. Tulip is, uh, is depicted. And that was a scene that was, was, was regular here and what he probably saw here. He didn't paint it here, but he probably saw it here. Um, the context for the bootcamp is uh, a European funded project called Europeana Space. And, and the aim of Europeana Space is to create new opportunities for employment and economic growth within the in creative industries based on Europe's rich digital cultural resources. That's quite a mouthful. And so the focus of the, 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 the hackathon and, and, and the talks tonight will be very much not only on the maybe the artistic quality of a prototype or the or the, the technological innovation of the prototype, but also focus on on the value that the prototype might create in the in in, in terms of job creation, in terms of uh, uh, um, um, uh, skills development, and uh, and how it, it actually can advance on economic levels as well. Um, Europeana space as a project. Uh, hosts a lot of different hackathons and boot camps. This is the first one actually. The others are in different countries organized with different par partners, but also will have different focuses and different, uh, different topics. So there will be uh, hackathons on dance and on photography and uh, a lot of other different issues. If you are interested in the project, there's some leaflets uh, that are out there and there's some people around in the audience. So over drinks, you can always also ask your questions relating to that project if, if, you, if you have them. Um, the lineup for tonight, the speakers, they are from multiple backgrounds. They come from broadcasting organizations, from more cultural organizations and from companies. And they focus all on different aspects, on audiences, on storytelling and on media. And we invited them specifically tonight because in the bootcamp there will be a continuous exchange, exchange between those three, between audience engagement, between content, and, uh, and technology. The idea of the sessions is that uh, each speaker 
we'll have uh, 15 minutes and there will be room for one or two uh, questions from the audience and uh, then we move on to the next one but at the end we also have some room to have a discussion in the in the, in the plenary in the group and uh, we close with some drinks downstairs <laughs>